Something amazing is going to be happening in the night sky on December 21st, 2020. It's something that hasn't been easily observable in several hundred years, and you won't be able to see it again until the year 2080. I'm Tim from the Cape Knights Gallery, and today I'm going to tell you how you can catch this easily observable but rare event. For the last few years, two of the brightest objects in the night sky have been the planets Saturn and Jupiter. From our vantage point looking to the southern horizon, Saturn has been chasing Jupiter and finally, on December 21st, is going to catch up. This is going to cause an event known as a conjunction. And it is rare, but it is even more rare that it will be observable at just the right time. Couple that with the fact that we're going into the winter solstice and we have effectively a 2020 Christmas star. This is going to be something that is easy for you to see. You really just need two things. One, of course, would be clear skies. The second thing would be a clear view of the southern horizon. It does not have to be all the way down, but get away from the trees and get away from tall structures. The great thing about these two planets is because they are so bright, if you're in an area that has light pollution, that's okay. These are some of the brighter objects that get through that. Don't worry about getting into a dark environment or some random field far away. You don't need it. Although you'll be able to see this with the naked eye, don't hesitate to dig out those old binoculars that have been sitting in the drawer or the closet for the last few years. This would be the time that you'd want to use them. Your window of opportunity lies between 30 minutes and two hours after sunset. After that two hour mark has gone by, those planets will sink below the horizon and you will have missed your opportunity. So that gives you a 90 minute window to see. Once you get outside, look to the southwest. With those binoculars, depending on their strength, it might even be possible to see the moons of Jupiter, allowing you to see two planets and four moons at least. And of course, if you have a telescope, you may even be able to see Saturn's rings. From our point of view, planets seem to move really slow, which means that if you don't have the opportunity to enjoy the conjunction, the peak of it on December 21st, you'll still have a window of opportunity to see this from the 19th to the 23rd during the same times. So hopefully that gives you a little bit of extra flexibility in case the skies decide not to cooperate on the night in question. Why not give yourself the gift of a few moments of peace and quiet enjoying this amazing astronomical event during the holiday season? Happy holidays to all of you, and I will see you again soon.